Hello motorcyclists. I am Ten, the manager of Friedkon brand by virtue of this opportunity. I am honored to be here with you to participate the functional analysis of Friedkon brand products. I hope to let more motorcyclists have further understanding about the products of Friedkon brand through this video. First it is our main unit T-Max Pro. Then it is the user's manual. Earphone clip base. Stick up earphone dock. Base Velcro. And our loudspeaker. The headphone jack is suitable for Android system. Flexible tube. This is our rigid tube. This is our charging cable. Two small round Velcro strips used to hold the flexible tube in place. For large round Velcro pieces used to hold the loudspeaker receiver. The last one the screwdriver. T-Max Pro is a classic impeller, streamlined modeling, minimalist and elegant appearance. There are only two buttons in the whole product. Multi-functions in one button, particularly strong blind operation, measured in the speed of cycling, quick operation in one second. One click blind operation without difficulty, interpreting what is called king of blind operation, making you look great with it on your helmet. I believe that a lot of people choose T-Max Pro because of the hi-fi sound quality but it can also adjust the volume automatically in response to the environmental noises, giving you a real sense of how convenient it is. You know that while you're in the process of riding at different speeds, the volume of wind noises are also different. At this time, surely you don't want frequent adjustment of the volume by hands. It's obviously that truly freeing your hands is the ultimate goal of the helmet Bluetooth headset. T-Max Pro supports intelligent voice control, whether it's to pick up and make phone calls, or to connect with devices, etc. All could be run through voice commands. To achieve true hands-free operation, T-Max Pro has many other features. For example, 6-user full duplex intercom is supported, music sharing, and connection with third-party brands. Good after-sales service.